Hey, people, Supreme Bear, and this is my first ever Q&A question and answers video. I asked you in episode 23 and 24 of my Minecraft adventures to leave in the comments some questions that you want to answer in. So now, time has come to answer these questions. Also did actually, on Facebook, I put a message there about people to leave me questions and I, I will answer them, but no one did on the Facebook, but that's no problem, I don't have much following on there. And without further ado, we'll get to the first question. So the first question comes from Radmaster13 and he asks, So Pete, what is your favourite type of underwear? Well, personally, for myself, I like to wear boxer shorts because they're nice and comfortable. Thanks for the question, Radmaster, and we're going to move on to the second question. The second question comes from Crazy AD, and he asks, Why don't I use the Gerudoku texture pack? Well, simple fact is that I just keep forgetting, to be honest. I will use this texture pack, and it will probably feature in a Minecraft Weekly at some point. I will use this texture pack soon. I just... I have a memory like a fish. Thanks for the question and gonna move on again. Question number three comes from Fraser Guy and he asks, is there a Mrs. Supreme Pete? And the answer is no. Not at the moment, but maybe after I finish with uni, who knows? And question four, it comes from PC Got Games and he asks what do I study at university? Well, I just study web design and development. Basically, coding websites in PHP and all that stuff and doing it good. And that's what I'm still doing at the moment. I've got about a month and a half left. No, maybe just a month left. But after the next two weeks, I'm pretty much finished. So, yeah, and to answer the other question, no. I'm not gay. Question 5 comes from the user Seveno War, long time subscriber now, yeah. So he firstly asks if I'm ready for some action. Some Action 52. I could never be ready for such one of the worst collection of games in history. No, I'm not ready for that. And his other question what's my favourite colour? Well, simple answer my favourite colour is blue. And it always has been. Moving on to question six, it's Pips the Pew Pew, a long time friend of mine. And he asks, when is the next Nubscast out? No, seriously, when? Well, for those who don't know, Nubscast is a podcast I did with Pips the Pew Pew and Noximus a while ago. And he wants to know when the next one's out. Well, he should know himself, because he does it as well, so... Your guess is good as mine, but I really would like to do it soon, as it's awesome, and the first Nubscast was hilarious and fun, at least in my opinion. Question 7, it comes from Bout30, and he asks, what is my goal for Minecraft? Well, it's hard to have a goal in Minecraft at all, and the number one goal as with most games is just to have fun really and meet new people and I've managed to do both pretty well so far through Minecraft and yeah I can't really set another goal for it at the moment but I'll let you know if I do question number eight now so it's from Beast Hacksaw I think well I can't really tell with the numbers or he was the rocks on my live stream a while ago. And he asked, how did I get introduced into Minecraft? Well, it's from very here on YouTube. I was doing random reviews of PlayStation 1 games and I come across Minecraft. I think it was CNanners who I found who was doing Minecraft back in ooh, October, November time. I'm not sure. And I decided to purchase the game. It looked really fun. And... Yeah, that's pretty much how I got introduced into the game. Question number nine comes from Mr. Sun Joni Video, and he asks, "What is my favourite Pokemon?" 
Well, I've been playing Pokemon since Red and Blue on the original Game Boy and my favourite starter Pokemon is probably still my favourite Pokemon today and that is Squirtle. So Squirtle is my favourite Pokemon. Question 10 comes from the Hopeless Brit, otherwise known as MP Labour 1, and he asks, What would be my dream job? Well, my dream job would be actually just making videos on YouTube and getting paid for it, but you've got to have a pretty massive following for that. And either way, if I got a massive following, great, and I make money, nice. But I appreciate my small audience I have now though so yeah thanks for the question moving on to question 11 and once again it's from the hopeless Brett he's sent me quite a few questions actually and he asked what's my favorite game very hard to answer really I mean if in terms of if you're talking in terms of playtime then World of Warcraft would would have been my favorite game but it's not so my favorite game Ooh, it's a very hard decision, and I'm going to have to go with the classic Legend of Zelda on the NES. This is a game that started me off in RPGs, and I love RPGs, so yeah, I'm going to say Zelda on the NES. Question 12, and surprise, yet again, it's from the Hopeless Brett, and thank you for these questions, I do like answering people's questions as your questioner asks and I wouldn't do one of these videos if I didn't want to answer anyone's questions so thank you for the questions and yeah the answer is yes I do like answering people's questions as long as they're not stupid question 13 and it's hopeless for it again good job man and he asks how would I feel if I woke up one morning and I gained over 2,000 subscribers overnight, or well, I would feel awesome. I would be just shocked, really. I mean, that would treble my subscriber count pretty much. And, wow, if that happened, I would want to know where they came from from a start. And, wow, that would just be amazing. But, yeah, I think that answers your question. Question 14, and it's the final question, comes from Yazazuki22, I'm sorry for the pronunciation, and he asks, what's the meaning of life? Well, common answer is 42, if you don't get the reference, look it up, but to me, the meaning of life is to have fun, to live a full life, and I don't know really, just have a fun life really it's a pretty crap answer I know but thank you for the question anyway and that is pretty much it for the video because there's no more questions so please leave questions in the comments below and I'll do a Pete's Q&A too and thanks for all those people who submitted questions I, I fully appreciate it so I hope this has been a fun and entertaining video if not then I apologize but what can you do and well like comment subscribe and I will see you in the next video of course so see you for now